and on the day of the report, the student was to come dressed as that person. Yes. And when they got in front of the class, they were to use first person I and actually become that person. <laughs> Happy hashtag appreciation day, everybody. Um, today's the day you're supposed to celebrate your favorite teachers. Has anyone left any comments about their favorite teachers in the comment section, internet uh, wizards? Yes, sir. <laughs> Barbara Underwood said, Stan Float was my favorite teacher at CB CPCC in Charlotte. He was a slab glass artist. CPCC? CPCC. That's CPCC. Central Piedmont oh, Community Oh, yeah, we had College. CVCC. CC, yeah. We had CPCC. It sounds very Russian, doesn't it? Yeah. Or communist, like, but when it was like Soviet the, Union. Yeah, the CCCP. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you know me. Well, my favorite <laughs> teachers were uh, Mr. Bell, Randy Bell. That was an art yeah. teacher. Uh, he did that hickory painting over there. And he still does some teaching at Ford. He does. Randy Bell, good guy. I'm um, going to say Miss Hedrick, hmm. sixth grade teacher. I didn't like her at the time. She spanked the crap out of me a lot. Yeah, well, you did. But I deserved it. it. You did. Not all of them, but I deserved most of them. But she is the one who taught me how to do homework correctly. Like, really got me a schedule. She got me focused, and I learned how to do it. I learned how to learn. Learn how I didn't to even learn. learn how, you know, sometimes you don't know how to learn. And then I had Mr. Sechrist, was a good teacher, Johnny Sechrist at Ford, uh, and Miss Sigmund. Now, Miss Sigmund, do you remember when we did Hickory Live, the TV show? We had oh, yeah, one yeah, pilot yeah. episode. Yeah. I had Miss Sigmund come on, and um, she was my eighth grade English teacher. She gave us a book report. And I'll just show you a little clip of me and Miss Sigmund on this pilot we did called Hickory Live. Check it out. Yeah, this was. But uh, he looked at me and he said, Carolina sucks. <laughs> you didn't use that word back in the 70s. No. <laughs> Can't say Carolina. Then. That's right. <laughs> to, for two reasons. Two reasons. You don't say that about Carolina and you just don't say that. Right, right. You got it. <laughs> That's awesome. So um, we, 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 we were reconnected not long ago. Uh, your daughter's a judge. She is. That's right. And my dad was a bailiff in her courtroom. Right. And yeah. I came to visit you. Yeah. You did. And my dad and, and you, you're like, of course you, you know judges. Me, uh, you want to thank me? I started your comedy career. <laughs> and maybe, and maybe. she's right. You want to tell everyone about this? There was a project that we had to do. There, there was. Uh, I, uh, being an avid reader myself, I always assigned book reports to students because I wanted everybody, all these kids to read. They didn't like to read, so I made them read by assigning book reports. And I tried to kind of change it up so children wouldn't get too bored. And this particular assignment was to choose a biography, mm -hmm. not to tell me or anybody the person who was chosen. And on the day of the report, the student was to come dressed as that person. Yes. And when they got in front of the class, they were to use first person I and actually become that person. Yes. So the day that John was to give his report, he came to me and he said, uh, I have to change clothes. I mm -hmm. said, that's fine. I'll have some other reports. You wait in the hall. I'll come and get you. <laughs> well, when I opened the door, <laughs> I know my jaw dropped because there stood John in a dress, yeah. <laughs> high heel shoes, yeah. Yeah. and I'm going to call it a pocketbook, a purse yeah. over his arm. <laughs> and, but, but John didn't miss a beat. He absolutely did not miss a beat. And keep in mind, he's walking into an eighth grade classroom. Think of your eighth grade years, yeah. eighth grade class. It was scary. Well, you, you weren't scared. <laughs> oh, I was scared. You just couldn't tell. Anyway. Acting. <laughs> exactly. But John walked to the, into the classroom, walked to the front of the room, turned around, faced the class, and said, do you remember Hi. what you said? No. I'm, okay, well, yeah, go, 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 go ahead. What did I say? You said. Uh, <laughs> Hi, I'm Rosalind Carter. <laughs> and, and I think he added, and I'm here to tell you about myself, and he did not lose Mrs. Carter. Yeah. He did not lose the character, which is absolutely. We actually, you recorded them. Yeah. On VHS tape. And that's another. And you gave it to me. Well. When you retired, you're like, you know what, I got these. I've been using, you said you used mine as an example. I did. To show other students how to do this. Yeah, sure. And we have the tape. Oh. <laughs> oh, you get to see me in a dress in the eighth grade. Oh, boy. Y'all want to see it? All right. 
Let's roll that beautiful bean footage. <laughs> Hello, my name is Ruth Van Collins. The first thing I'm going to talk about is my childhood. <laughs> I was born and raised. Everyone's turning around. Looking at people. He can't even look. One day, me and Ruth were staying. That's my mom's dress. Uh -huh. I was just I sprung this on her last minute, by the way. I know, we all do this. I said, Mom, I got a book report due today, and I got to dress up like a girl. <laughs> I became a first lady of the United States. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And my husband I'm not sure what Rosalind Carter's hair because looked like back then. I bet you it wasn't far off from this. No, it's close. <laughs> There you go. Wow. Right, that's good, the Alan Jackson. So, wow. <laughs> thank you, Miss Sigmund, for making well, me do that. I know that. Miss Sigmund, I know her. I know her. Yeah, well, her daughter is a judge. Yes, Amy. My we played basketball together. She gets, she's got me at least one or two divorces signed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's good. My, my yeah. dad worked with her, and he was the bailiff there. Yeah. So, yeah, <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> hey, it's me again. Thanks for watching the video. I hope you liked that. If you did, you, uh, you should check out the entire episode. It's a blast. And then if you're going to do that, you might as well subscribe. And then, you know, if you're going to subscribe, you might as well hit the notification bell. All right. And, uh, and know that I love you. <laughs>